All right, Math 7 students, so today our con is called finding the area of a circle. Actually, it's called area of a circle, but we are going to work to find the area of a circle. So, um, in order to find the area of a circle, you need to know another formula. If you remember, on the circumference of a circle, the formula was circumference equals 2 times, I'm sorry, 2 times the radius times pi or the diameter times pi. Okay, and you got to know that formula, just like you have to know the one today. So please write this down in your notes if you need to, so you can remember this. It'll be useful for you on quizzes, on tests, moving forward, and on the assignments. So the formula today for the area of a circle is the area of a circle is equal to pi times the radius squared. So you have to find the radius of a circle, square it, and then multiply it by pi. So let's put that into action. We'll do this problem. The radius of this is 5, so we're going to do the area equals pi, which for pi, we told you yesterday, they like to use 3.14 for pi, so we're going to do that. So the area equals pi, 3.14, times the radius squared. Now, in order of operations, we must square this number first. That must take place first, and 5 squared is the same as 5 times 5, which is 25. Then we take pi times 25, and we get 78.5, and that's our answer. Yep, it's that simple. But what if they don't give us the radius? So for example, we have this next problem. Down here, they're telling us that the diameter is 16 of a circle. Well, we know that if the diameter is equal to 16, then the radius would equal 8. You just take half of the diameter. Then, once you know that, you're going to plug into our formula. Area equals pi r squared. So we'll do that right down here. We will say the area equals pi times the radius of 8 squared. Well, 8 squared, 8 times 8 is 64. So we're going to take pi times 64. And 3.14 times 64 is 200.96. So as soon as you know that formula, you've got that formula memorized and you get everything down into radius form, finding the area of a circle is actually quite simple. Have a great day, guys. Bye-bye.